Hi guys, this is a tutorial on how to use the scanner of this uh, Xerox machine, the Work Center 7120. We'll go to our computer and type the IP address of that machine 192.168.54. If you do not know how to find the IP address, we will search here. The IP address is here 192.168.254.102. Okay. Now we have just input the IP address in a web a Chrome a website, in Chrome uh, browser, Centerware Internet Services. This is the CWIS, and we go to the properties. is asking for the password admin the username is admin and the password is 1111 okay we will enter the admin after that in the properties tab properties tab look for the connectivity under that, look for the port settings and we'll notice the W scan, the port WSD scan, we will enable it, then apply. Okay, and after that, you can reboot the machine. Now it's been uh, rebooted. Now it's restarting now. It's already rebooted. Okay. How to install now? Uh, we go to the control panel. Uh, here is a control panel then add printer add printer we will wait and the machine will appear here the computer will search for the printer and scanner then go to the control panel I will repeat control panel Look for the devices and printers. Then add printer. We we'll wait. Now you can see now the work center 7120 printer and scanner. We will install this now. Installing now. Now it's already installed in your system, in your Windows 10 uh, computer. We'll have a test print. Okay. <coughs> now it's printing. Let's increase the printing. Now, 
now it's already installed in your computer and now we are going to scan this scan so that uh, we can uh, store it in our computer This is the 7122 that was installed in our computer. Okay, you can see the scanner scan files, start scan and scan properties. This is the scanner, I will test. The imaging successfully completed the diagnostic test, so it works now. I will test scan. Just wait. Okay, you can see this and scan. It's already installed. But if you if is uh, you can install it in your laptop or computer you should install the uh, via or what we call the train driver now this is the scan document now as I have present to you a while ago so you can scan now in your 7120 work center But if you can, uh, if the uh, serif machine is or if if you can see this and you can start the scanner, maybe you haven't installed the twin driver or and the via. We'll go to uh, search for scanner drivers. Okay look for via or train driver okay we are here now download this download then uh, install it in your computer then you can use now your scanner and you can also scan a document here in a windows scanner Windows fax and scan. Okay, just open this uh, software from native Windows uh, 10 software. Okay. New scan. Okay. We'll use this uh, work center 7220. Okay, establishing connection now. Okay, then scan it now. Just wait for a while. Okay, it's already scanned. And just save it. Save it into your uh, hard drive. You, if you want to scan another another file, okay. this one. Go to the computer and 
New scan. You can scan in the feeder. You can scan in the flatbed. But for now, we have put the original document in the flatbed. And uh, we can uh, save us a JPEG or BMP and PNG, PNG, PIF and XPS documents. And the resolution, we can put it 600 dpi for a higher resolution. Okay. If you scan. That was the picture that I put in the flatbed. No? You can save it now. File name. Sample. Okay. okay. I hope I, I have shared a knowledge about the work center 7120 and how to install the printer and also on how to uh, scan a document or a picture in your machine thank you for uh, viewing this tutorial